Max Hope, Tech for Big Broadcast. And more of today's news. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I played Minecraft all day yesterday. I didn't wake up until 2 p.m. IUK will be holding a bilingual family night here at FHS on February 12th from 5.30 to 7. Did you miss the first fast for night? Well, don't trip, because February 25th, the Purdue Extension Office will be hosting another one from 4.30 to 7. Good luck to all band and orchestra students as they perform at District Solo and Ensemble Contest tomorrow at Kokomo High School. I believe in y'all. To show our school pride, Student Council is welcoming each community to participate in their door decorating competition. Tuesday and Wednesday of next week during community will be your decorating times. And then judgment will be reaped on Thursday. Deck After Dark is tonight from 5.30 to 7.30. The final payment for Deck Estate is due no later than today to Mrs. Bishop. For lunch today, on lines 1 and 2, there are pizza sticks. Line 3 has a rib sandwich. Line 4 has many corn dogs or calzones. And line 5 is close. A happy birthday goes out to Lucas Medina, Mason Redmond, and Brandon Hornbuckle. Now let's head over to weather and sports. Thanks guys, it will be cloudy all day with a high of 34 and a low of 25. There's a 40% chance of more snow showers tonight, but if not, we should still expect some flurries throughout the day. So dress warm hot dogs. That's all for weather. Now to Juliet with sports. Thanks Calissa. The boys swimming results against Logansport are in from Wednesday. The dogs beat the berries 91 to 73. Top swimmers were Malachi Galachin, who dropped 29 seconds in the 500 freestyle, and Terry Fry, who dropped 21 seconds in the 100 IM. Girls' swim sectionals the last night went great. Placing in top eight were Carly Bessler, Aub Aubrey Teeter, Carly Santos, Patience Dean, and the Melly Relay. Patience Dean in the 50 freestyle and the 100 backstroke, Carly Santos in the 100 butterfly, and Carly Bessler, Kylie Adams Long, Carly Santos, Patience Dean, and the 200 freestyle relay. Good job and the best of luck to all who are going to finals. The counting wrestling meet that was scheduled for yesterday at Rossville has been rescheduled for February 19th. This will take place at Rossville starting at 6 p.m. The boys football summer schedule is out. Make sure to check out the Hot Dogs Athletic website to see the schedule. That's all for sports. Now back to your host. On a side note, that counting meet is for the middle school. But good luck to Elijah Anthony and Christian Matias as they compete in the regional tomorrow. Are you a senior? If you have held a job within the past year, you've probably gotten taxes removed from your paycheck. If that's the case, then you have to file taxes. Yay. I also bet you have almost zero idea how to do that, because I know I don't. Well, you're in luck, actually, because FHS will be assisting us in learning how to file those pesky W-2s. It will be March 3rd during community. Once we know where, we'll let you know. Sign-up sheets are in student services, and the deadline to sign up is February 28th. Tech for Big Broadcast starts Monday. The first performance starts at 4.30. Have your music ready. Act 1 Tech start on Monday, Act 2 Tech start on Tuesday. If you're not there for Tech, you will not be in the show. There is also a rundown of the show located outside of Mr. Dennison's classroom. Any questions, please see Mr. Taylor. Winter Homecoming Week starts on Monday and the theme for the week is Winter Wonderland. The following spirit days are Polar Express PJ Day on Monday, Tropical Tuesday, Wide Out Wednesday, Ugly Sweaters on Thursday, and Friday is our usual Hot Dog Pride. Are you a girl interested in pursuing an engineering degree? If so, please join the Women in Engineering program for your college campus visit at Purdue University and enjoy a comprehensive engineering experience. It is a one-day engineering-focused event geared toward young women there in their junior or senior year of the high school. The day is Monday, April 20th from 8 a.m. to 4.30. If you're interested in this opportunity, check the chatter for the link to register for attendance. Now, let's, hope, let's go to Ms. video with Mrs. Long for the Big Wheel of Fun. Hey hot dogs, it's time to spin the wheel of fun. We're gonna do an extra day today, so we're gonna have three big winners. Here we go. Lucky number 44, which is Carolyn Stallcup. Carolyn Stallcup, we might have to get some help letting her know. Second one. Number eight, Amanda Graham Bishop. Amanda Graham Bishop, you're our second winner and our final extra winner today is... Number 15, Chris Butler. Chris Butler, Amanda Graham Bishop, Carolyn Stolkup, 
We've got prizes. Come on down. That's it for the 38th day of 2020's version of the announcements. Be sure to like and subscribe to continue to see your favorite hosts, sportscasters, and meteorologists. And I just remembered I have cookies on hold, so I'm going to head out real quick. Wait, what? Oh, uh, oh the, the first XFL game table takes place tomorrow, so my team is the Dallas Renegades, so don't call me a bandwagon when they win the championship.